Hi, my name is Alex Fleischman, and welcome to the video overview for the transverse and longitudinal waves demonstration. This demonstration will introduce students to the topics of transverse and longitudinal waves. Teachers will place a slinky on the ground and move it left and right to demonstrate transverse waves, and move it in and out to demonstrate longitudinal waves. This demonstration will include an introduction to constructive and destructive interference. Let's begin this demo by having two students hold both ends of the slinky. One student moves the slinky left and right. These are called transverse waves. So what happens as the wave reaches the stationary side? The wave bounces back toward the moving end, but the wave is now flipped. The bouncing back of the wave is called reflection. The wave has been inverted due to the stationary point of the second holder. So what would happen if the other side was free to move? Well, the wave bounces back toward the moving end, but is not inverted. Now let's have both students move the slinky left and right. What happens to the waveform when the two waves meet? Well, the waves can cause either constructive or destructive interference. Constructive interference occurs when two waves merge together to form a bigger wave due to the waves being in phase with each other. Destructive interference occurs when two waves cancel each other out completely due to being completely out of phase. Now let's have one student push the spring in and out. This waveform is called longitudinal waves. What happens when the wave touches the stationary side? Well, the wave is reflected back toward the moving end.